So nothing wrong if she's older. It doesn't mean she wouldn't respect you. Like I said, she's not respecting you because you're older. She's respecting you because she chose to. And think about that. Hi family, welcome to this channel. This is Soja of God Studios where we share sermons from Pastor Chris, Hubert Angel, Benny Hing, and so many other ministers that we know that God himself has called for this end time mission. So if you love God's word, then you are at the right place. My name is Prince and today's sermon is from Pastor Chris once again. This is a very important uh, same or why because many of us are are wondering if what is God's take in when a man marries a woman who is older than him I believe this is a, a question that you've asked yourself before so what is God's take in this when a man marries a woman who is older than him uh, so without wasting time family we shall get in, into the video shortly but personally i know a minister of mine a friend and a minister who has married a woman who is older than him i think five years difference so let's see what pastor chris will say about this matter let's play and listen to the same what has age got to do with relationships, especially when the lady is older than the guy, by say two or three years? Nothing. That's enough, isn't it? Are you planning on that? So if, if the lady is older than the guy, some people say, ah, if she's older, she won't respect you. She's not respecting you because you're older. Have you ever thought about it? <laughs> Have you ever seen some little, little, small lady running some great guy? <laughs> you haven't seen them? I have sometimes, I have. This little lady, she's sharp. She's tough. She's younger, she's smaller, she's everything. Laugh. <laughs> <laughs> and she runs the guy. You can't believe. It. I mean, when she tells you about her husband, you, you don't know who she's talking about until the guy comes in. And you are amazed. This hefty, hulky looking fellow. <laughs> Small lady. Somebody one time said small girls are dangerous. <laughs> I, I, oh, actually, I, I don't know how such a great guy gets in love with that little lady. God only knows what he saw. But truly, hmm. <laughs> Well, see people are, at the end of the day, they are not really disadvantaged by their size. Uh, okay, family, so as we just heard Pastor Chris, uh, really size isn't uh, a disadvantage, never, as well as age. So remember, they are just in love. So let's see what Pastor Chris will say next. But if you are, see, ladies, um, all the time you trying to be careful. You see, I, I said some things on Sunday during the first service. I hope you got the message. See, if you get if you get bigger than your husband, he doesn't know how to go out with you. When you want to go out, he has so much to consider. <laughs> so much to think about. So much. 
so much. So much to think about. He needs three and a half yards for his clothes, you need seven. <laughs> Financially is burdensome. And then when you go out, you are the big one. And he's he he doesn't like to appear like your driver. And funny enough, it's difficult to find a big lady with a big man, and I don't know why. You know, just like the other way, you know, this little girl, you know, getting a big fellow. You also find one young brother, smallish in stature, and he tells you he wants to get married. You look around to find, who is it? And the lady comes out. <laughs> well, I can guarantee you that <laughs> no matter what you look like, God has the right fellow for you. Amen. 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 So I like that side that Pastor Chris says that God has um one for us i believe that god has destined um the right way for everyone so i believe in prayer i believe that if you are single and you are looking for a wife or a husband put it to, into prayer god has a way to direct the right person to you right so let us listen to the rest of the sermon amen, amen. You know, I heard one lady, one lady one time, small in stature, and she said, uh, she told the congregation, she said, you know why I shout? And of course they said, no. She said, you see, I'm not easily noticed. <laughs> Praise the Lord. So she would like to shout. You get to know there's a madame in the house. Ah. So nothing wrong if she is older. And it doesn't mean she wouldn't respect you. Like I said, she's not respecting you because you're older. She's respecting you because she chose to. And think about that. She doesn't do it because you told her to. She's doing it because she wants to. Because she wow, family. Wow. Wow. So I believe Pastor Chris has answered the question. There's nothing wrong with, with this, with a man marrying a woman who is older than him. So now you can tell your friends, you can tell your family members, it is not wrong. What we always say that the woman will not respect the man, no. Right? So it, there's nothing wrong with it, biblically as well. So I believe Pastor Chris has addressed the issue for us easily. So family, God bless you for watching this video remember remember to pray with the word of god med meditate on his word be in his presence and everything is really going to be okay god bless you and god cares for you bye bye